Good morning, my brother. Welcome to your daily grip on God's Word. Hey, let me pause. It's great to be back with you. But I really want to thank Brian for bringing us home in 2 Samuel. Thank you to Steve. Thank you to Joey. I'm beyond uh, grateful and, and just feel incredibly blessed that God has brought those three men in to help shepherd our daily grips and other men like you that are watching that are just rising up and um, shepherding uh, the Word of God to others. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I get to start us in the book of First Thessalonians, and the purpose of this book being written, I'll just share it with you, is to strengthen the Thessalonian Christians in their faith and give them the assurance of Christ's return. It's been, uh, this book is authored by Paul. So let me dive in, and I pray you guys will be encouraged, um, pray that you'll be blessed, and let's dive into chapter 1 of First Thessalonians for me. Two verses rose up, two and three. So here's my G for gripping the word. Ready? We always thank God for all of you, mentioning you in our prayers. We continually remember before our God and Father your work produced by faith, your labor prompted by love, and your endurance inspired by hope in our Lord Jesus Christ. So that's my G. Let me go over to my R, and I'm going to read it off a, a digital format here. So my R is, I deeply resonate with these verses as I apply them to each of you who have plugged into the In His Grip community. I thank God, our Heavenly Father, for each of you. The pursuit of your faith has nudged me, has nudged you to get involved. You have been prompted by the love for God and for the love for your brothers in faith. I have witnessed many of you persevering as your hope is not in the world but it's in Jesus Christ. As Steve Shelton would say, I'm inspired to be engaged with you guys. And I am, guys. I'm so inspired to do this with you. So that's my R. That's my review. My implementation is to keep showing up for my 5 a.m. tea time with Jesus. Consistency is mission critical. Here is my morning... Oh, my morning... Alarm is the master's theme. Do you know you can just download that for your ringtone? So every morning at 5 a.m., the master's theme song comes on, and I, it just helps me jump out of bed. Hey, whatever it takes. My role is to be an encourager to the men that God has placed in my life and even encourage them to be encouragers to other men. Knowing my hope is in Jesus, I can persevere and continue to run the race that is set before me to truly finish strong. Let the boil my implementation, finish strong. My prayer, Lord, thank you for the men you've brought into the Innis Group community, starting with the board of directors, with Joey, Brian, and Steve, who helped come along and get involved in the front lines of the ministry with the grips. Thank you for the multitudes of men you are nudging to step up and lead a group, become a prayer warrior, and share their time, their talents, and their treasures with your ministry, you are using to build your kingdom here on earth. Lord, I am beyond grateful for my family. Thank you for blessing me with an amazing wife and Leslie, and an amazing son in Micah. In Jesus' name, amen. So, guys, I just come out of this with uh, gratefulness uh, for you, for many of you that are just standing in the gap. And know that, remember we had a goal to get up to 300 uh, prayer partners. So as of this morning, we're at 356, and I feel the prayers um, covering myself, my family, the ministry. And if you have an interest in getting a Sunday night uh, praise and prayer report that I just type up, the praises for the previous week and the prayer requests for the upcoming week, just send me your email back or just respond back. I'll get you plugged into that. How crazy we got that up to maybe like 500 men. Uh, every Sunday night, praying and bathing in the ministry and prayer. How awesome would that be? So let me close this out with a word of prayer. I look forward to continuing this journey on with you for First Thessalonians, five chapters of it. And um, just join me in prayer, would you? Heavenly Father, as we just bow in humble adoration to acknowledge you and the penning that you did through Paul in this great book to the Thessalonians to encourage them. Lord, I pray that that encouragement spills over into us. That can only be done through your Holy Spirit. Now, Jesus, thank you for all that you're doing in and through our lives, in and through the ministry. Uh, Jesus, you get all the glory. It's all yours. 
And we pray this in your powerful name, in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you guys. I will see you in the morning.